a loop is a way of repeating a statement a number of times until some way of ending the loop occurs. In a loop, a statement block is executed several times in succession. If you do not specify any additions, the statement block is repeated until it reaches a termination statement such as exit or stop. Three loops are used in ABAP do, do n times, while. If you want to process a statement block more than once, you can program a loop with a do statement. Avoid endless loops when working with do statement. If you don't use the times option, include at least exit, stop or reject. The termination statements that apply only to the loop in which they occur are continue, check and exit. Continue is used for terminate the loop pass unconditionally. Check is used for terminate the loop pass conditionally. Exit is used for terminate the loop entirely. Stop is used for terminate the loop. With the addition n times you can limit the amount of loop passes the numerical value of n at entry in the loop determines the maximum amount of passes of the statement block. The control structure does not accept a change of the value n within the loop. If n contains a value less than or equal to zero, the statement block will not be executed. If you want to process a statement block more than once as long as a condition is true, you can program a loop with a while statement. While statement runs till when the logical expression you have give fails. In conditional branching statement a condition is evaluated, branches are used for control the program. If the expression is true then the statement or block of statements gets executed otherwise these statements are skipped. This statement permits the programmer to write a single condition, and execute the statement if the condition is true. ELSEIF statement is useful where two or more alternatives are available for selection. Then various conditions are evaluated one by one starting from top to bottom. If none of expression is evaluate to true, then the statement or group of statement associated with the final else is executed. This statement permits the programmer to write a single comparison, and the execute one of the two statements depending upon the condition check. ELSEIF statement is useful where two or more alternatives are available for selection. Then various conditions are evaluated one by one starting from top to bottom. If none of expression is evaluate to true, then the statement or group of statement associated with the final else is executed. ELFEIF statement is useful where two or more alternatives are available for selection. 
then various conditions are evaluated one by one starting from top to bottom. If none of expression is evaluated to true, then the statement or group of statement associated with the final else is executed. The case statement is much like a nested if else statement. When the case statement is executed, the expression in the case statement is evaluated and the control is transferred directly to the group of statements whose when label value of the expression. If none of expression is matched, then the statement or group of statement associated with the final others is executed. ELSEIF statement is useful where two or more alternatives are available for selection. Then various conditions are evaluated one by one starting from top to bottom. If none of expression is evaluated to true, then the statement or group of statement associated with the final else is executed. Hi there. Let me show you how our training courses work in this short sample lesson. Just follow the on-screen instructions here is the small program of addition. There is the two parameters A, B and one data C which store the addition of the parameters. Hi there. Let me show you how our training courses work in this short sample lesson. Just follow the on-screen instructions now showing a factorial program.
End of slide, thank you.